Welcome to this Ctrl-M support video solution. This video will show how to configure Ctrl-M Enterprise Manager web server to only accept connections using the secure protocol TLS 1.2 in SSL communications, together with specific ciphers to adhere to site security standards. Even if not explicitly defined, a secure HTTPS connector can be activated by the Tomcat web server. The installation of the Ctrl-M automation API, for instance, creates this connector automatically. It can happen that during a penetration test performed on the site, Ctrl-M administrators are notified by the security team that the product is accepting SSL connections using unsecure protocols like TLS1 or TLS1.1. To fix this situation and to remove Ctrl-M ports from the penetration test warning report, it is possible to configure Ctrl-M Tomcat web server to only accept a secure protocol like TLS 1.2 and, if required, only a selected set of ciphers based on SHA 256 encryption algorithm. The configurations used by the web server are contained in a file called server.xml located in the Tomcat conf directory. The HTTPS connector created by default will be listening on port 8443 and will enable all TLS protocols, so including TLS 1 and TLS 1.1, which are not considered secure. The standard non-SSL connector listening on port 18080 will redirect eventual SSL requests coming into this port to the secure 8443 port. In our demonstration, we have the web server active and listening on port 18080 HTTP and 8443 HTTPS. We are simulating the penetration test trying to communicate with port 8443 using an unsecure SSL protocol. To do that, we use the OpenSSL S client function from a different server connecting to the port 8443 using protocol TLS1 and asking to simply show the certificates returned. In the output, we can see that the SSL communication has been established using the unsecure protocol. The same happens if we use protocol TLS 1.1. And also with protocol TLS 1.2, the result is the same. To configure the web server to refuse connections with unsecure protocols, we have to edit the server.xml configuration file. Navigate to the directory tomcatconf located under the ctmem etc emweb path. On a Windows platform, the path is slightly different. The tomcatconf directory is under the controlmem default emweb directory. Save a backup copy of the server.xml configuration file. Edit the configuration file. Locate the line where the HTTPS secure connector is defined and add the SSL enabled protocols attribute to the connector definition. If you have the requirement to limit the list of possible ciphers, you can add the ciphers attribute specifying the list separated by commas. At the end of the changes, save the file and exit. To activate the changes, you need to recycle the web server using the commands stop web server and start web server. When we try to connect to port 8443 using an unsecure SSL protocol, we can see that now the connection cannot be established because the web server doesn't allow other protocols than TLS 1.2.
trying with TLS1. And then with TLS 1.2. The web server port will not be part of the next penetration test warning list. Control M products come with self-signed certificates installed by default. If you receive complaints by your security team about the use of self-signed certificates, then it is possible to create new certificates that will meet site standards using the Build Your Own Certificate Supplied Procedure, shortened to BYOC. For more information, please search into the knowledge base and in an SSR guide. This concludes this Control M Solutions video. Please see our knowledge base and YouTube channel for more videos like this.